Alright everyone, welcome to jobskillshare.org Help the support entry level to specialists. The section that we are going to talk about today is under remote help and VPN Virtual private network. This is so important for someone who is new to IT who is getting into IT is because you get these type of questions all the time in interviews. So guys know this stuff, practice it and just work on this stuff because if you if you can talk about some clients in your interview you're gonna look so good and you just will get that job hopefully alright let's go to this diagram that I have I really don't do a lot of you know presentations and things like that but this is kinda important here we have a small business it's a small business right here oops sorry wrong one so let me go back here <laughs> all right so this is the small business okay and in this business at this time there's no virtual thing going on there this is just just take this out of your image right now just don't think about this think about this this is a small building there are six people in this building okay and then there's like a router there's a firewall there's just basic networking going on here forget about this also just basic networking going on and there's domain controller and there's some email servers and things like that and this company you know when 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 these people go in there they work and nicely get done after five or six and then that's it everything is going great right but the only way to this go to this company is only this bridge right here this is the bridge this is a physical bridge and these people live right here okay they leave their house they just eat some egg and some I, I drink chai so they drink chai this guy drinks coffee and blah 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 and they just go in there right one day the safety department whatever they call they just come and say you know what today we're blocking this because we have to fix this bridge this is so important because we cannot risk anyone you know uh, we don't want anyone to die so they just block this now what happened is this there's some really important stuff going on in your company that some vendors need to get into your company or you need to get to your machines and you know you need to tell you need to do something because this is gonna cost you millions of dollars if you don't do that okay or it's a big chance for you to make million dollars so your boss tells you you all need to use VPN and you're like what what is VPN now that would be these people right here these employees are gonna say what okay but you as an IT person is not going to say what you're going to say oh let me help you so you pro this is why I say you need to know as an IT person you remember when we are doing these learning things we are you're 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 looking at it from your eyes employees looked at look at this thing from different things they just want to know wh where's the software and who is going to help me so you as an IT person is going to be helping your clients installing VPN on their machine VPN clients basically so there's a server and the server part is configured by your networking guy now if you are that one uh, one man IT person then you're going to be configuring this or if you have a big team then they are already configured it now 99% or 90% of the time it is already configured when you go to the interview VPN stuff is already configured all you need to know is how to install it on the client machine this involves two things first you need to know how to install it second you need to know if something goes wrong you need to know how to troubleshoot it number third you need to know you need to document this thing so if you have too many people you just send them documentation now most of them get it but some people will need help and that's where you will need to know this stuff that's why I, I share this diagram so you guys kinda kinda know what's going on so now let's get to the little bit real uh, technical stuff like you know how does it look here we got a we have a nice example right here which is a VPN server this is basically a server running on this machine okay as you guys can see it's listening on these ports right here now that's something that a networking guy basically set it up for you you don't need to set this up like I said most cases 90% of the time you will not be that person but you can be that person if you're a one-man IT person and you're learning stuff so this is already set up 
what your server administrator will do or your company will do is that they will tell you as for for you for a help this person they will give you some clients installation like this okay so for example this is our client installation right here I'm just gonna go to my documents and make a VPN okay and I'm just gonna double click here and just say this okay now this exe file is already configured for jobskillshare.org okay we have already configured this on this right when we went there we say you know what we're going to allow people on this virtual private network which I created um, as a server guy so or someone in your company I am just gonna say oh you know in this virtual private network I only want Stacy I only want Donnie I only want this person to come to this uh, to get to this uh, this uh, private network right here so basically it's like a it's 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 a virtual hub inside of your server now most of the the VPN servers are like this you can create a lot of technical stuff and we're going to have a full course on VPN server side so then you guys will know everything that you guys are looking right now as right now I'm definitely sure when you look at this stuff and you're new and like what the hell is he talking about so that's why I just wanted to show you guys what's the other side you know there's three sides there's employees they just connect by using this client right here there's you that will need to get this client from your server guy and then you need to install this and troubleshoot it and do things with it and then the third person is your server guy who have already configured this stuff right here this involves networking you need to know about networking because that's involved IP addresses virtual hubs security things like that will get involved in that so that's a little detail stuff and that's why we say we're gonna have course on that so okay now let's go back to the client okay now my example I'm using this VPN server client and all I have to do is to double click on it this is already configured and most of the people will configure it because then you don't want to tell people that oh this is our server address this is our this is this or that they put this port in the client and this that that you need to have a really nice documentation for that but most of the time people have configured so what they do is basically they'll just double click on it and all it does is they'll ask you okay do you want to install the software that's a basic net like you know net, uh, Windows security stuff and then just click next they get the prompt next and they click next agree to the agreement that's kinda like the normal way of uh, installing any software and once it's installed what's gonna happen is that it's going to start it's going to connect you to the company network and going back to our it's basically what's going on right now is you're installing this on this machine it's authenticating it to the server right here what's in once it's authenticated you're gonna get a prompt because everything went well okay so right now it's doing its thing